If you want your children to master advanced math operations like addition and subtraction, you have to teach them this concept first. In this video, I am going to share tips and activities for you to teach your children part-whole relationship. So keep on watching this video. Hi everyone, my name is Finn and welcome to another Fun Home Learning Friday. For the past three Fun Home Learning Fridays, I have been teaching this popular topic, numeracy success in preschoolers, and I shared several numeracy skills that will help your children gain competence in math and work with numbers competently. Go check out these earlier numeracy success videos if you have not done so. I've added a link to the playlist in the video description below. I am so thankful for this opportunity to work with HP Singapore to produce all of these Fun Home Learning Friday videos and these printables. Now speaking of printables, I have designed over 15 learning printables that cover topics like numeracy, literacy, modal skills for HP Singapore. They are all free for you to download over at HP Printable website. Click on the link below to get to HP Printable website and grab these printables. As a busy mother of three, I have a long to-do list every day, so I really do not need more items on this list. So I am really thankful for my HP Instant Ink subscription service that sends ink automatically to my home whenever my printer is running low on ink. I never have to run to the stores or buy ink online anymore. To top it off, with HP Instant Ink subscription service, I save up to 50% on printer ink. Right now, there is a 3 months free trial promotion and this is a great chance for you to try this amazing on-demand ink subscription service for free. You can find out all the details and sign up for HP Instant Ink by clicking on the link in the video description below. I am sure you're going to love this convenient and cost-saving ink subscription service as much as I do. This is Numeracy Success Episode 4 and let's talk about part-whole relationship. Part-whole relationship is the understanding that a number can be made up of smaller parts. So for example, I have 5 markers here and I can split up 5 markers into 3 markers and 2 markers or 4 markers and 1 marker. Now why is this concept so important? Understanding part-whole relationship will help your children compose numbers and that is to combine parts of numbers together like 4 and 1 makes 5 together. This concept also helps your children to decompose numbers and that is to break down a number into its smaller parts. Like 5 can be split into 3 and 2. This ability to compose and decompose number lay the foundation for your children to learn addition and subtraction in the future. To teach parts home relationship to your children, give them plenty of opportunities to explore this concept with concrete materials. And for younger preschoolers under 4 years old, we want to work with smaller numbers like 3, 4 and 5 first. Now I'm going to share a simple activity that you can try at home with your children to introduce part whole relationship to them. First, you will need 20 blocks in 2 colours, 10 for each colour. Place the blocks all over the table, then invite your children to make caterpillars that are 4 blocks long. When they are done, ask them to count the number of pink blocks and the number of blue blocks on their caterpillars. All the caterpillars are 4 blocks long, but this caterpillar has 1 blue block and 3 pink blocks, while that caterpillar has 2 pink blocks and 2 blue blocks. And this caterpillar is entirely pink, has 4 pink blocks and no blue blocks. For older preschoolers, you can take this activity one step further by drawing these cherry diagrams for each caterpillar and have your children fill in the missing number. And of course, I have a printable for you this week, introducing our printable of the week, Ladybug Math. And this is a great one to introduce part two relationship to your children. Let's set up the activity now. First, we're going to print out the printable. Then, prepare a little black paint and a cotton bud. During the activity, invite your children to add dots on the ladybug so that the number of dots on the ladybug adds up to the number on its head. For example, for this ladybug, the number on its head is 4 and there are 3 dots on the left. So we have to add just 1 dot on the right because 3 and 1 make 4. Go download this printable over at HP Printable website and try this activity with your children today. 
I hope you are loving all of these printables and numeracy success videos so far. Please share the videos with all your friends so that more children can benefit from these resources. And be sure to subscribe to my channel so you will not miss any of my fun home learning Friday videos and printables. See you next Friday. Bye-bye.